Now, breaking news from CBS 17 News. Breaking news at noon, the state's insurance commissioner says he is rejecting a massive hike in homeowners insurance rates in North Carolina. Thanks for joining us. I'm Liz Ortiz. And I'm Bill Young. A group representing the industry had asked for an average 42% increase statewide. Our Capitol reporter Michael Hyland joining us. And Michael, what happens now? It could still be several months before there is a resolution to all of this, but Insurance Commissioner Mike Causey told me that even with all the issues the industry has faced, that 42 percent goes too far. So he announced this morning that he's rejecting that proposal, and there's been an October 7th court hearing date set. But between now and then, it is possible that he could reach a settlement, which is typically what happens. The North Carolina Rate Bureau submitted this request last month, citing rising costs due to inflation, construction costs, and risks particularly at the coast. In some beach communities, the Bureau asked for an average increase of 99%. People uh, cannot stand the, the type of increase that's been proposed here. And I, I understand some of the factors involved, but the insurance companies have got to do a better job of rooting out fraud, reporting fraud. Commissioner. Commissioner Causey said his agency heard from more than 25,000 people in the last month, almost universally opposed to the requested rate hike. So what should people realistically expect once this does finally get resolved? I'm going to have a closer look at all of that coming up new at 4. Live in Raleigh, Michael Highland, CBS 17 News. All right, Michael, thank you.